So this is a video of the guy Yahweh Ben Yahweh Ben Yahweh who promotes luxury cars and his luxury Yahweh mansion. But then I found one of his um, fan pages and this Latino guy on this video is going to hold up the Baphomet horns after saying praise Yahweh and that he only prays to Yahweh, the man who promotes luxury items and women showing their cleavage. So they all wear that shirt, King Yahweh, okay? Let me show you who King Yahweh is right quick. This guy right here. I kept on seeing his pictures pop up in my news feed. And he's treated like a king. Hold on. But I saw this girl right here. This girl, she's from Love and Hip Hop um, Miami, I think. And look at her cleavage all out. And he gave her a necklace saying that she's a queen and all this stuff. And he promotes all of his rich life. That's his mansion. That's his car. That's, the, that's his Lamborghini. But then he got women in front of the Lamborghini with their cleavage out. Look at her breast all out. And they're supposed to represent the light. So I was like, this don't make no sense. So I just wanted to find more information on him and then I found this video. Did you see that? So you see that he's holding up the Baphomet horns there. This is not a game. There is no reason to throw up the Baphomet horns after saying, saying praise Yahweh and I only pray to Yahweh. And he's wearing King Yahweh on his shirt. So he's talking about the man who I showed you in the pictures. Yahweh, Ben Yahweh, Ben Yahweh. It's like his name is over and over again. Now, let me type his name in, hold on. Okay, so here it is, Yahweh, Ben Yahweh. And he acts like he shares the light. See? Praise Yahweh. But there, he's talking about himself. And then he just had a big 10, 10th year anniversary. That's how I saw him. And this is him. See, it says 10 year anniversary. Birthday bash. King Yahweh's private mansion celebration. So he's calling himself King Yahweh. Like he's the Messiah. And this is him talking to the girl from Love and Hip Hop, but she's at his mansion. And these are people at the mansion. Look at the lady in the middle. That's not how women who follow the light of King Yahusha dresses. That's the man. This is the man who was holding up the Baphomet horns. That's him. That's the Latino man that was holding up the Baphomet horns in the video. So that's my proof that this man does not represent the light. Look at all these people sitting on Yahweh Ben Yahweh's um, Lamborghini. They want what he wants. This is the girl from Love and Hip Hop. That's the necklace he gave her with her titties all hanging out and this old slip. This is satanic stuff. This is a lady wearing the King Yahweh shirt. And they put the Drew, the Hebrew. Um, Paleo Hebrew. So they're acting like they were they follow King Yahusha, but he's saying he's the Messiah. This Yahweh Ben Yahweh, that's him. That's him. 
That's the man. See, he's wearing that King Yahweh. That's the man who was holding up the Baphomet horns in the video. That's him. And now he's inside of the Rolls Royce. That's the same man who was holding up the Baphomet horns. That's the mansion. That's the Latino man that was holding up the Baphomet horns. Saying he prays to Yahweh. So, um, this man... He does not represent the light of King Yahusha. Yahweh bin Yahweh. People better be aware of who they're following these days. I share the light. And I don't tell nobody to worship me. But I know I'm one of the 144,000. But he is not. Here it says over here. King Yahweh is the gods of gods. We are the most unverified verified community on Instagram. It's impossible to do what we do and go ignored. King Yahweh. He's calling himself King Yahweh. And over here, it says, the kingdom of Yahweh, 10 year celebration, commemoration, serving the global community by way of our humanitarian efforts, displaying and demonstrating charity and being a fine example of excellence and nobility. Also, we strive to build a working rapport to connect and inform our global family and friends through the means of our unified working efforts and through the online lens of entertainment and unfiltered news concerning global affairs. As we strive to eradicate pain, suffering throughout the world and replace it with love, peace, and happiness. This don't have nothing to do with King Yahusha. The Bible don't say nothing about what he's saying. We're not supposed to bring peace and eradicate pain. We're supposed to follow King Yahusha's instructions and then have judgment in hell. And then King Yahusha will create a new city. It don't have nothing to do with man. Next paragraph. We have been successfully serving the global community for 10 years strong and counting, and we are looking forward to serve, connect, and offer our help to all the seven continents of the world for the next 10 years and beyond. And our sub-motto is, we are going to save the world and look good doing it. One good person at a time, sincerely. Imperial Majesty King Yahweh and the Royal Family of Yahweh Keep your eyes on the prize and hold on. So, he has nothing to do with King Yahusha. He represents himself. Okay? He represents himself. Here, here, he's speaking for the United States and Israel. The Illuminati. But then he puts a Bible verse there. Anybody can put a Bible verse. But what is your life showing us? What is What are you displaying on Facebook for all of us to see? And what is one of your main followers um, doing on a video holding up Baphomet horns? And now we see you with the United States satanic flag and the Israeli satanic flag. Both part of the Illuminati. And you're speaking there as if you're spreading the light. No. This is all a trick. And I'm seeing this for a reason this week because this man has a huge following and I'm not jealous. I'm, I was confused, but once I saw the man holding up the Baphomet med horns, everything made sense. But at first I'm like, I'm so confused. Let me show you his mansion. Okay. So right here, this is her name is Shay Johnson, the girl from love and hip hop Miami. And this is her talking at his mansion and look how she's dressed. So if he represents the light of King Yahusha, why are women dressed like this at his mansion? And why is he promoting the lust of riches? It's just a question. I just walked through the entire house, which is amazing and beautiful. Um, I already met Yahweh. I met his family. Everybody is positive here. I haven't felt any negative energy since I've been here. I've been taking pictures with the family. I just feel like comfortable. I feel like I've known these people forever and I have never met any one of them. That's the energy I like to be around. So, we're going to enjoy this house, enjoy the people, eat some food, drink some H2O because that's all we have. 
and just live life. Now again, she said, I just met Yahweh. So King Yahweh, according to the, this man, he's King Yahweh. Not Yahusha. He's saying he's the Almighty God. So, I just walked through the entire house, which is amazing and beautiful. Um, I already met Yahweh. I met his family. Everybody is probably here. So, that's what she said. She said, I already met Yahweh. This is a girl from Love and Hip Hop Miami. With the way things are in hip hop culture right now, she does not represent the light. And for her to come and promote King Yahweh, that tells you something. But again, seeing that Latino man hold up the Baphomet horns is icing on the cake about what this King Yahweh is all about. This is the two of them. That's King Yahweh, according to him and her. And look how she's dressed. And she's from Love and Hip Hop Miami. She's dressed according to what Love and Hip Hop Miami is. But for him to act like he's the light, this is very weird. I don't understand. And he has a huge following. The people who are following him are crazy because they are not following King Yahusha's light. Okay, in this video, She's showing the necklace that he gave her and she's going to talk about how amazing the house is and look how big this house is. A person sharing the light would not live in a house like this. So, I just received my gift from the kingdom of Yahweh. Isn't it gorgeous? I will wear this all the time. Look at this amazing house. It's going to be the Okay, this is the final part of the video. This is icing on the cake. They do not represent the light. They're like Christian gangsters. Watch. This is Yahweh ben Yahweh ben Yahweh and his group or his um, entourage. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. 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 Thank you, Lord.